What is it guys, this is part 17 of the Grand Theft Auto 5 Let's Play. Yeah, so there's a mission right up here. The Federal Bureau mission. Let's just get it done, boys. Aside from my brother background. Uh, 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 these nuts. Got him. Ah, ah. Yep, and this is the bike that he steals. Hmm. Can I rob my own store? I just get money from my own cashier place. Like my damn, you know, like I bring like just one grenade. <laughs> rad rats, yes! That's a big one, and then there's a baby. Sorry for my brother, guys. I bitch. There's a regular rad rat. Wait, what is this? Uh, wait, are these? Oh, these are baby rad rats. Sorry for my brother, guys. Oh, wait, no, they're, um, yeah, I, I just killed them, sorry. I'm not a murderer if they're trying to kill me. Oh, nice place you got here. Oh yeah, it's easy to mock, isn't it? Huh? Cheap and fucking easy. Oh, need any But uh, this, this here is my place, and my work paid for my place. All right, relax. I was just being sarcastic. Yeah, well, don't be, all right? Because the world doesn't need any more sarcasm. It's the blight of the age. Yeah, I get the point. You, I get the point. You're like every other asshole. You need a bit of money. Bad news for you. I was always a turd. No! You weren't, man. You were something. But now, man, yeah, you're like this yeah. place. You're a shell. Go fuck yourself. Are you some kind of pure morally justifiable asshole? Like but because you're 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 like, totally you're like psychotic, like somehow it's okay. Yeah. I'm honest, all right? You're the hypocrite. Oh yeah, you're a fucking hero. So far above it all. Oh yeah, well I'm not above ripping open your fucking chest to see what's replaced your heart. Rip it open. See what's there, baby, because I'm ready. Damn. No? Oh, ladies, ladies, what's up? Fuck off! Listen. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry. Do you have any lead? But we've got a problem. Government funding thing. We need you to uh, investigate a research lab upstate. Yeah, that terror is a big me. one. Nerve um, gas, um, biological terror. We got jangles and moon monkeys. Pay tax. Now listen, you'll need some fairly standard gear. Boat, tandem rotor heavy helicopter, truck, Weapons. I'll have to source all of that. <laughs> Chopper alone will set you back a couple of mil. I oh, no worries there. Trevor here, he just came into a lot of money. Is that sarcasm? Mm -hmm. Oh, you're fucking A right at sarcasm. You Why is the fuck. damn quarter dinner? A few weeks ago, I was happily retired, sulking by my swimming pool. And my psychotic best friend shows up out of nowhere to torture me over mistakes I made. Honest mistakes I made over a decade ago. We, our little posse, are flat fucking broke. But hey, let's go out and spend two million dollars on a tandem rotor fucking chopper so I can go steal nerve gas from fucking terrorists. Forgive me, you ignorant fuck. But sarcasm is all I fucking got. So what is Sarcasm what, uh, so what level and a room you? full of you cunts. Yes. Woo. Welcome back, man. It is the old you. Ha. Yeah, uh, yeah, no. yeah, well, we gotta go. Uh, it's been Indian great, dog. but Dave here's got a Pilates no, class. No, now, remember, ladies, you keep us way out of this thing. Oh, hi. Bye-bye. Um, oh, oh, hi. Wait, oh, you're not Mickey. What the fuck? I'll get Lester. He said he knew about something. Now, you tell him that we're driving towards Polito Bay. Get the hell, Derek. I don't even care if you're making a fucking video. You're driving us up to the bank. Out, you little fucking shit. Sorry guys for the background noise. What'd you say, Derek? Sorry guys for the background noise. Wait for Trevor. Trevor is slow. Go to Blitter Bay. Hmm. Let me call Lester.
What now? We got a funding problem, so we need a job. Before the jewel store, you talked about a score, a, a bank in the sticks. I need you to meet us there. Polito Bay, right? That's the one. I'll get on a bus. All right, Lester's meeting us there. Don't start. I won't. No way. Good call. If you're taking down a bank for a few million, oh, the worst yeah, thing yeah, to yeah, do is yeah, call the yeah, hospital yeah, and tell them to get you a guy in a wheelchair. <laughs> oh, this AC bank, you gotta be carrying that kind of change? Out. Local law enforcement extort money from all the weed farms, whorehouses, meth kitchens in the area. They keep their cash in safe deposit boxes. Then there's all the normal small town payroll stuff. We should do well. You know, I've been thinking about you, Trevor. Your lifestyle. Okay, I'm oh, yeah, gonna you. Really? Yes, I have. People always try to leave you. You know? Maniac, psycho, friend. Industry leader. Uh, some ways you defy categorization. But then, what? Think about it. Where you live. Sandy Shores, you precious ass. I'm sorry there ain't a place nearby for you to get your colonics. Right. But why are you out here? It's off the grid. We're away from it all. It's somewhere real and authentic. This is America! And real people ain't been priced out yet. Yeah, well, what if it gets gentrified? Then I'll fucking move. Okay. What about the way you dress? What about it? I don't give a shit what I wear. No, no, no. If you don't give a shit, you wear clean clothes that fit. So yours are all a little out there, you know, a little wacky. Whatever's in the shop is what I get. Jesus, what is this? It's not an absence of taste, T. It's the opposite of taste. You should be a style. And then there's the tattoos, the hair, the weird music, the funny toys, the niche drugs, the everything. What the fuck are we talking about? You are a hipster. What? You're a hipster. I hate hipsters. Classic hipster denial. I abhor hipsters. I eat them for fun. <laughs> Hipsters love saying they hate hipsters. What I really fucking do? Self-hatred. Common hipster affliction. Why well, won't be because I'm living out here away from the bean machines and the bankers? You're gentrifying. Soon, the skinny jeans will show up, then the skinny lattes, and then the bankers. And you'll be somewhere else, starting the cycle I'm all bored. over again. Maybe you're not a classic garden variety hipster, but you're what the hipsters aspire to be. You, Trevor, are the proto-hipster. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about, you bullshit. You're trying to wind me up. But I'm very, very angry, and I want this conversation to stop right away. Hipster. Fuck you! Fuck you, Michael! Say it again. I've made my point. I'm not a sadist. The bus stops up here. All right. How long does it take us to get out here from LS? And they got a hotel, slept in it, and then. Thanks for listening. Break your fucking fingers, you don't knock that shit off. Well, please, alright, you alleviate the boredom. Ah, finally. Hey, hey, hey. Fucking paradise. Come on, cars this way. Cry out here. Don't worry, brother. Mark will take care of all your moisturizing needs. Shall we? Might as well get started. Drive us to the bank. And we'll go to the front of the bank, clock the entrance. If the paperwork's correct, the alarm will be a relic. We should be in and out before the local PD knows what's happening. <laughs> the prison, this is my content. I'm gonna hot dog. 
Then I'm gonna crash this fire hydrant. Do that. And then I'm gonna crash in this fire hydrant quick. Damn. See how it's my content and my HT videos? Take us around back. Okay. Notice how I'm gonna start as well. There's an empty lot behind, and no one should pay attention to us back there. I like it. Yeah, the place is remote, it's got the right amount of foot traffic. This'll do. Mm -hmm. It's not ideal. It's gonna cost more to break that system than the score is gonna pay. This is the score. What are our options? It's a dumb idea, but we could trigger the alarm. See what kind of response they throw out. That is a dumb idea. Hey, you heard the man, all right? Oh no, shoot the sucker.
Jesus, what took you so long? I had to let you win. <laughs> Set up a board over here. Oh. Michael, man, your blood sugars are low. I'm making you some leftovers. I'm fine, T. Huh? No, I'm the host, man. You know, I don't want you to get hungry and moody, right? Then you're gonna be making the wrong decisions. Man, I've been making wrong decisions my whole life. That's how I ended up here. Here you go. Bon appetito. Jesus Christ, Trevor, what is that? What's wrong with you? That's just a... a what? An eyelid. That's probably not even human. Unless the gas station job. Gentlemen, some plans for your attention? Good. I'm gonna stay here a minute longer than I have to. So I think our little uh, experiment showed that the response will be too quick to beat and too strong to walk through. That means you gotta face the cops head on. Dirty cops. Uh, the dirty cops head on. Head on. Man, I don't know. Well, you'll be prepared. Convoys carrying military-grade hardware pass near here to get to Fort Zancudo. I propose hijacking one and using the equipment to get an edge on the locals. I can get you the exact details of the shipment as soon as we're done here. Anyway, you won't be outside the bank too long. Polito Bay is, well, it's a bay. So you're a street away from the water where Franklin can be waiting in a boat to get you out of there. I know none of this is ideal, but it's the only way I can see of taking the score and providing for your FIB paymasters. Fine. We need personnel? Just a gunman. They'll be taking on the cops with you, so my advice, choose someone good. Ah, think about my buddy's chef, okay? Consummate professional. Mm -hmm. I want you to sure see. this is the guy? Confirm. That should do. I'll get the equipment together. Michael, you reach out to Franklin. Trevor, mm -hmm. you do what you do. Roger that. I'll call you when we're ready to move on this. Mm, you want a bunk with us? I mean, it's gonna be tight, but, you know, me casa, su casa. I'll get a motel. Thanks. Not shop. Fine. I'll give you a ride. Adios, amigos. Mm -hmm. for you, homie. Some angry motherfuckers. I found where they stay, man, and I've been following them. Okay. Well, it's gotta be the O'Neill brothers. <laughs> What's left of them? I'll pick up Michael, and we'll come to you. T! Hey, man! I'm just gonna switch to Franklin to get this do 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 done. Man, me and Chop on these punks. We coming up to WH, north of two miles. 
All right, all right, the O'Neill brothers are coming to us. I think they was about to send one of them anti-tank rockets into your Vespucci condo, where one of your roomies told them that you was gone. Okay, so if you're on the WH, that means you'll be coming through Ratton Canyon, right? Shit, I guess. Good. Me and MT are gonna take the company chopper and meet you there. Company chopper, yes, Michael, it's a tax write-off. Frank, you still there? Yeah, I'm just about holding on to the road. We're taking the chopper and we'll head you off. Deal with these oh. business stealing pricks on the road. Hey, dog. Elk in the road! Shit, shit, shit! you go, man. Look at you go. Oh, shit! Bruh. Trevor, man, shit, you there? There was a deer in the road, man. These motherfuckers crashed out. They crashed? They dead? Nah, they gone. They ran into the fucking woods, man. I need air support, like, right fucking now.
Taking out some hillbilly crank dealers on a blood feud. That's what I live for. Hey, Trev, man, we gonna borrow this and head back to town. Sure. Come on, Michael, man. I'll drop your ass off on the way back. Chuck, get in. See you back in Castle Phillips, Mike. Yeah, thanks for the warning. Better do. <laughs> All right, cool. Well, guys, this is gonna be the end of the episode. Hope you guys have enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye bye.